Hello, I'm Jenny Halla and I am an Akashic Records guide, um, soul activator, and a badass. <laughs> okay, so I've been feeling a lot of energy this morning and I feel that a message is going to come through from the Akashic Records that is for the collective. I almost didn't turn on the video because I'm just still in my Sunday hangout gear. But the thing is, is that we, this feels like it's part of the message too, but it's like we as a society, as a collective, as people could really benefit from being present to what is and allowing ourselves to follow the nudges, to follow our intuition, to follow our guides, to follow the things, even when we don't feel like the conditions are perfect or that we're not dressed properly or whatever it is. It doesn't have to be that, but like that's just an example to really follow the nudges and allow things to move through us, allow the inspiration to move through us, allow ourselves to build that trust muscle with ourselves. So let me see what they want to share, what the record keepers and guides want to share today. It's time for you to be free, to feel free, to connect in with the vibration of what freedom means to you at a soul level. Now, the thing that we are talking about here is not 100% freedom of the mind. Yes, there are facets of what freedom means to the mind and to the ego, and the layer that we are inviting you to connect to that is a deeper layer and a deeper level is the energy and frequency of freedom at a soul level. Ooh, I just felt a wave of energy with that. And what it means, ooh, there's a lot of energy with this and there's like energy moving in my throat that sometimes can mean that there is um, some blockages for some people here in the throat to, to speak. Oh yeah, I feel that. To speak their truth and to really say what's on their mind and ask for what they want and begin to, yeah, move things with that. And so by connecting to freedom, what it means at a soul level, what it means at a, at a deeper um, energetic soul frequency level is really understanding Mm, they're like sending like multiple things to me at once. So give me a second to receive it and share it. So it's like connecting to freedom in so many levels. So they're going to give some examples here. So it's like the freedom to speak your truth and speak your voice, the freedom to be like, have your heart open and be who you are. And they're reminding me of this morning is I've been listening to a song that's really been touching me deeply of um, JVKE is the band or the artist group, whatever. And the name of the song is Golden Hour. And when I hear that song, like, it, it's like, it's something like, see you shine. Like, I just want to put my arms out and up, like all the way up. Like, and it just brings tears to my eyes. And then the follow-up thing is like, it's your golden hour. There's such a truth in the energy of that, of when we allow ourselves to be seen, when we allow ourselves to be heard, when we open ourselves up to even more possibilities than what like our mind and our limiting beliefs and our limitations, they're like saying like show and allow for us because it's interesting. There's like two different um, scenarios, I guess, that they're giving me where it's like, if you are operating from the place of the mind and like the connection into that, it's like there's a certain set of things, opportunities, um, whatever that, that you can see. It's almost like there's this box that's here. And so it's like your life operates within this box or these limitations or these things where it's like when you're looking around you see opportunities but it's like they can only oh wow they can only go as far as like this 
invisible box because it's like when the energy is coming from the mind oh my god this is so deep and i feel like this is for me too like there when the energy is coming from the mind the mind puts this like energetic um box around it this is so deep um and when it's coming from the heart when it's coming from the soul when it's coming from this deeper place there is no energetic box around anything and that's what they're inviting us to tap into to tap into the freedom <laughs> the freedom that exists that's available that's always been available there's a sense of freedom when it comes from the heart when it comes from the soul that's available at all times once again they're wanting me to remind you and all of us that it's not a hundred percent the freedom from the way that the mind views the word freedom and whatever is elicited and triggered from the place of the mind ah and they're saying that this is an exercise that you can do to be able to feel the energy and perhaps see or experience the difference and so if you get out a journal and you write down like mind or your name you know like i would be like jenny what does freedom mean to Jenny? And that is going to come more from a place of the mind in a lot of cases. Um, you can even say mind. What is the free? What is the definition of freedom? And then really moving down and, and going into a new question and asking heart, soul, even asking your higher self, what is the definition of freedom? Higher self, what is the definition of freedom? Soul, oh, that feels really good. Soul, what is the definition of freedom? What can I know about what freedom means for me? How can I step into an even deeper experience and understanding of freedom from a new perspective? And write down what comes through. I will tell you that this is, this is Jenny sharing now, this is a very powerful uh, practice. This is actually a, a slight variation of what I do in Akashic Records training. I'm teaching others how to open the records for themselves and receive messages. And this is one of the um, practices that we do so you can feel the energy between like yourself, your higher self, and the Akashic Records. So I encourage you to do this because there is a difference energetically in where you're connecting to and where the information is coming from. And then also to like the vibration, if you think about the vibration of freedom from here, like they said, there's that energetic block around it versus the vibration from the energy and the soul. Like for me feeling into it, the, 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 the feeling that the record keepers are giving me right now is just such this place of expansiveness. It's like, my mind, I'm shaking my head because my mind can't comprehend this expansiveness. And there's a level of trust of being in this space of the unknown expansiveness of what else, what else is there? <sighs> there's a lot here. And I invite you to sit with these energies to see what comes up for you, to let me know in the comments what comes up for you if you'd like to share what came up from the mind, what came up from the soul, or even what came up from the soul, from the heart. I would love to hear how this, you know, like what came up for you in this practice. If you want to go deeper into the Akashic Records and you really want to expand in your journey, there's a lot of different ways that you can connect with me on that. So if you want to learn how to open the Akashic Records, I have a training for that. If you want some one-on-one -on -one support, in learning how to trust your intuition and opening up even more to trusting yourself. I have some training for that too. And lots of other things because I had a really powerful download for a mystery school type of offering in the next year. So stay tuned. Um, if you want any of that, you can hop on the email list. That's the best way to start. Jenny Holla, J-E-N-I-H-O-L-L-A.com. You can join and get free channeled messages from the Akashic Records like there's one just came out recently that had a bit of a like workbook type thing and they don't always come like that but all of these messages are super powerful just like the one I shared today and of course please like share and comment with anybody else who you feel like could benefit from this message I'm grateful for you being a part of this journey I'm grateful that you were here I'm grateful that you spent time with me and I'll see you soon